Guys, look, I've got a jelly bean. How cool is that? And a neon berry. So these are much better rewards than normal, guys. Look at this. Look at all of this good stuff here, guys. This is really good stuff. You get lots of tokens. And, uh, well, I'm picking up a heap of capacity as well. Hey, guys, it's Hoops to Be back with another Beast Swarm Simulator video. And today, guys, well, we're going to finish off the Stigbugs Nymph Hats uh, quest. Yes, there it is, guys. We've almost finished. Uh, 44 billion pollen, guys. Now, that is not actually as hard as it sounds because you're going to be busy doing other tasks. But you're going to get 10 billion from the pineapple patch, 6 billion from clover, and 5 billion from dandelion. Now, the problem there, guys, is it's using all the one booster up in the mountaintop. So you're not going to get them done all awfully quickly but you know guys it's not going to take too long if you've got a super smoothie just bang it out and uh yeah well good luck guys good luck with that now the other thing you want to do guys is you want to play the stick bug and you want to get yourself a bunch of tokens yes 250 tokens from the stick bug so you basically have to collect the tokens that are around the stick bug when he dies now this is the problem guys there's only about 20 25 tokens and uh, well you need 250 50 so you're going to kill the stick bug a lot of times guys and if there's a lot of people on the server well everyone else is grabbing them as well so there is that too guys but just keep going you can do it guys now the stick bug defense well there's those little totems that you see in uh the other fields they're easy to do guys they're just grinding a little bit of pollen and uh, yeah there it is so now we're going for it guys we're going to go for it we're trying to get these little guys uh, some hats yes it's so they look look at those eyes those funny eyes guys funny eyes i even like ginger boys like what is going on here with these things yeah he doesn't even know what's going on guys ginger boy knows nothing anyway guys so let's keep on going guys now you're going to craft 150 ingredients with blender oh i better go and do that right now guys i had completely forgot about that now i always like to keep some gumdrops going in the blender guys because that does help a lot and you, when you need for quests guys it's always available so let's click on here and boom in crafty boom there you go there's my uh, things guys we should probably start some more going actually because i do always need gumdrops and look it doesn't cost much guys it doesn't and cost much and they do take a long time to craft so you might as well have them going as well all of the time so let's just confirm that there's three hours worth of gumdrops so let's keep going guys now the next hardest thing in this quest line is the falling coconuts yeah well the, you need 500 falling coconuts guys now what are falling coconuts well basically coconuts that you get from the coconut field oh oh look at that guys i didn't get it I wonder why, guys. I wonder why. Now, this is the problem with the falling coconuts, guys. Let's try this again. You want to center yourself somewhere in the field, guys. And you want to be ready. And you're going to run across the... Oh, I didn't make it again, guys. Now, there's the problem. Here's the problem, guys. You don't choose a big field like this. You go into a smaller field because it's going to be a lot easier to get those coconuts. So, let's... Oh, well, we can't even kill these guys. But look. Uh, boom. There we go. And now we've got these other coconuts guys this is the haste coconuts yeah this comes whoa that was amazing now that was the coconut canister protection yeah that's another way to get falling coconuts guys the good thing about that is well you can get that like every five minutes so just run yourself into a mob and you'll get it now sometimes you get lucky guys sometimes you oh, didn't make it again guys so you want to have the small fields for your coconuts but let's go and claim the hive guys and we'll talk a little bit more about these coconuts coconuts now a small field is actually uh well the coconut field so that's actually perfect for collecting coconuts you've got to collect 500 guys now how do you get 500 well you basically have to kill the coconut crab you'll get a bunch of coconuts then you can also come into here into the coconut dispenser and well i just got 12 coconuts so that's pretty good guys now i talked about the bag before uh let's have a quick look at this guys you've got the coconut clogs now this just gives you movement speeds guys nothing Nothing really happens you get extra pollen from your coconuts but this is what you want guys the coconut canister because it has a passive inspire coconuts and a passive emergency coconut shield so both of those drop like five coconuts on the field guys and that's going to make grinding a lot easier let's go out of the field and try this right now guys uh yes boom Let's put it down the sprinkler and boom, let's get one of these guys. Now, I'm just going to get one of these passive tokens, bang. And now, look at this, guys. I get like five 
uh, coconuts falling in the field. So that's really going to add to your numbers really quickly. Now, the other thing you want to notice, guys, is uh, even in a small field, I had time to, to react then, guys. Uh, you have this thing called auto on and off, right? So if I put this auto on and we get the first coconut, that's great, guys. Now it has a 10-second cooldown. Yeah, 10 seconds, guys. 10 seconds. Okay. And now we're ready to go. Two, one, and boom. Ah, oh, we're waiting, guys. We're waiting. Now, this is the problem with the cooldown, guys. Yeah, it's a random thing, and you're going to get a random coconut in the field. You don't even know when it's coming. Oh, there we go, guys. Boom. Now, if you want to do this quickly, guys, that is not the way to do it, right? Turn the auto off and just manually spawn them. Get yourself into the middle of the field and spawn it, guys, and boom. You're going to get it every time. And because it's going to be hard to collect these coconuts, guys, you don't want to miss them. No, 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 no. We don't want to miss our coconuts, guys. We don't want to miss our coconuts. So let's just get a few more of these coconuts, and then we can finish off this quest. I need literally two more coconuts, guys. No problems. If I was waiting for that other thing, it would take, like, forever. Grab that Inspire token, and we're almost there, guys. We're almost there. So then there is only one other thing to do. Where is my coconut? There it is. Let's go. Boom. There it is, guys. We're done. So that's the coconuts done, guys. Uh, yeah, you want to get yourself into the coconut crab. There is a prerequisite for this stick bug. You need to have done the coconut crab because you're not going to get enough tokens. Now, you probably won't have the canister, uh, unfortunately, but you can get a lot of coconuts. Oh, and there is one other way to get coconuts, guys. Uh, if you can get into the coconut field and drop a sprout, right? Oh, seriously? This is going to take, like, forever. Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pop this sprout, guys. I'm gonna record this and, uh, <laughs> probably add this in another video somewhere. Because this is a huge legendary, guys. Look at the size of that legendary. It's massive. So, the only way to, uh, beat that is to throw some, uh, clouds <laughs> onto the field, guys. I'm gonna need a bunch of clouds. Seriously, let's just throw a bunch of these clouds because it's gonna take, like, forever. Ah, uh, boom. There we go. We've got the windy up anyway. So, this is good. Uh, legendary. Boom, 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 boom. Yes. <laughs> it's an insane, guys. That was an insane thing. But as you can see, guys, we're getting coconuts. We are getting coconuts. It's just another the sprout right like a legendary sprout you get them like all the time so that is another way to get coconuts guys so you could possibly do that even if you haven't uh well done the coconut crab if you can sneak into that field after it's popped uh well then you could obviously collect coconuts it's that easy guys it's that easy so there is one more thing we need to do for this quest before we can claim it and it's discard the bee equips guys now you want to be collecting your bee equips all the time guys you want to be using these stockings basically the stockings are going to give you some trashy bee equips you can get rid of boom all right so there's a, a scarf and uh, yeah you can go through the whole list guys and see what amazing things you've got or you haven't got but you have to basically get rid of a whole bunch so let's just get rid of those now uh yes so let's go back to the storage oh let's get rid of a warm scarf why not boom it's out of here all right so now we've done it guys we have completed the quest Oh, wow, that took a lot. So that's Digbug's Nymph's Hats. Let's go and claim our reward. Now, of course, you're going to have to actually be able to talk to Stickbug. So you are, do need the translator, guys. You do need the translator to pick up this quest. But uh, it wasn't too bad. The coconuts is probably going to be the hardest thing you're going to do. And getting rid of all those beer equips. All right, let's go, guys. Let's talk to the Stickbug. Yes, you pulled through. Oh, these hats are a perfect fit. Go ahead, try them on, Nibs. Oh, yeah, look at that. That looks cute, guys. That does look cute. Uh, that blessing gives bonus capacity, instant bee gather, conversion to honey per pollen, and bee attack. It stacks up to 250 times and lasts 8 hours. Should be a nice boost to your hive. What the? Seriously? My stick nymphs are happy, raring to go. How about we test their new hats out now? Boom. Wow, look at the rewards, guys. And there, Wow, that's not so good. 50 billion, uh, 5 gingerbread, 50 tickets, 250 bitterberries. Guys, that is not real great at all. But look at this, guys. We have... we. Oh, what the? They're not even the ones... I thought I was going to put elf hats on. But the thing, guys, with these nymph hats... Well, there's one. There's. Let's get him here. Let's get this guy. Let's get him. Right. Basically, they're going to drop cool stuff for Beesmus. And uh, basically, you get snowflakes and gingerbreads. And you could also get gumdrops, pineapples. And the usual things, guys, you could get... A 
Nymph Blessing. So if we have a look up here, guys, I got a Nymph Blessing now. Plus 1,000 capacity. Yes. Instant B. What? Instant B gather conversion and 1% of pollen, guys. So this is going to be kind of OP, right? So if you've been busy, uh, right, look at that. Look at this really good stuff, guys. Look at this really good stuff. Where's Baboo? Wow. I'm like killing it way too quickly. I'm too interested in all of the good stuff you're going to get from this. So the rewards from the actual quest are not so good. But, uh, well, you're going to get these uh, special nymphs. And, uh, yeah, they're going to drop some really cool stuff, guys. Uh, snowflakes and everything like that. And boom, we're going to get gingerbread. I want to get gingerbread, guys. I want to get some gingerbread. Let's see if we can entice the stick bug to drop a few nips our way. Oh, we've done it again, guys. That was too easy. Uh, let's go back to the clover field. I think he's like doing it easy for me at the moment. I don't even have my demon mask on. Let's get up there, guys. Let's get up there. Boom. All right, let's, let's do this. Here we go. Oh, no. Here's one. There's one, guys. There's one. Let's see if we can get this guy to convert into something other than just honey. Seriously? Come on. Give me something decent. Oh, you're supposed to get decent stuff, guys. You're supposed to get decent stuff. But anyway, guys, as you can see, well, my stacking has been stacking. And uh, now I've got extra capacity, which is pretty cool, guys. 6,000 capacity. I've got 1% uh, B attack. So that hasn't stacked, but that capacity is getting big. So that's pretty good, guys. Now, he's going to disappear again. Probably back to bamboo. Yeah, yeah, of course he is, guys. So basically, don't give me trades on. Guys, look, I've got a jelly bean. How cool is that? And a neon berry. So these are much better rewards than normal, guys. Look at this. Look at all of this good stuff here, guys. This is really good stuff. You get lots of tokens. And, uh, well, I'm picking up a heap of capacity as well. So, guys, this is the stick bugs. Nymph hats. They are pretty OP. Uh, the rewards weren't too great for the actual quest, but the stick bug challenge has got even more interesting. Anyway, guys, that's all I've got time for today. Please like and subscribe. And until next time, it's bye for now.